Hey guys, it's Landon with RH and On Point Workshops, and I'm going to run you through a quick task in Google Earth. So I've got a client that, that likes to use Google Earth on uh, one of the jobs that we're working on. And so I've got a, a KML file here. Uh, it's actually a KMZ file, which is just compressed KML, zipped up KML. Um, and it's got some uh, points that we've mapped uh, in a Venza which is a, a mobile app you can get and uh, it just has our our line marking uh, points so everywhere we have a, a blaze or a sign <clears throat> but while we were out uh, marking our our lines on this survey we did find a few locations where uh, the brushing crew uh, which is is working for the client uh, they need to do a little more uh, cleanup on some of the um, some of the line so what I want to do is I want to send the client uh, a, a KML file. He doesn't need all this. He all these uh, what they call place marks. He only needs um, the the areas that we need new. Uh, I, I sorry, the areas that we need some brushing. So what we're going to do, you can see here when you open the the KML file, it comes it opens up in your temporary places. So I'm going to uh, add a, a new folder here, and I'm going to call it uh, brushing to dos. And uh, we'll be able to, uh, hopefully, to drag uh, some place marks in there. So I'm gonna just drop this down. And we'll be able to cruise through here and find... Okay, so right here we have a monument with no bearing trees, but we need the tree trimmed. So I'm gonna cut that. And then we can come down and drag it or paste it into this folder. Okay, and let's see, let's just start down at the bottom because it'll be easier. Sorry, my, sc my screen just went black. So we're just looking for areas where we know we need new brushing. Okay, so right here we, we need more brushing. We need the correct line brushed. We need to brush the corner. Uh, we need to brush the correct line. So these right here, and you can see we got pictures too. Now, so it's not going to let me. Let, let's see. Well, let me. Yeah, it might let me drag them, guys. So we'll we'll just. So I left clicked left clicked on them and held down the shift key to select them all. And then we'll drag them down. I think that was all of the brushing work we saw that needed to get to, uh, needed to be done. Let's just double check. Okay, so I believe that's it. Uh, so what we want to do now is we want to um, export these as their own KML. So we're going to uh, right click on the folder brushing to do's and we'll say save as and uh, we're going to that's fine brushing to do's we like to do all caps. I'm going to call this brushing crew tasks. Okay, and then just to just to we'll go ahead and uh, delete that now. And I'm going to remove this. We don't need this anymore. And let's open up that new KMZ. So brushing crews and let's make sure that works the way we want. Okay, and so it did. So here's uh, where we need to brush to the corner. Need to brush the corner. Uh, we need um, the tree trim there. Uh, we need the correct line brushed, and we, um, and we need uh, more brushing here. So there's two spots here. Okay. And these actually should read the same way. Let's see here. Oh, you know what? I bet these are duplicates. Yeah, these are just duplicates. So one of these can get deleted. Okay, so now we've got a, a KML or KMZ file with just what we want. Oh, let's see. So I made that one change. I deleted that. So I'm just going to save and overwrite it. And uh, now we can just send this right to the client, and they'll know where we need more brushing. So if you've got if you've got a client working in Google Earth, um, that's how you can uh, you know you can create. You may not know, you, but in Google Earth, you can create your own folders and move place marks 
and other uh, Googlers features like paths and, and areas. You can move those around and drop them into different folders and then uh, simply right click on the folder and say save place as to create a new KML or KMZ file. Um, and, and these have, uh, you know, these have the pictures, so the client will be, op op be able to open this and they'll be able to see, uh, see the pictures and the work that needs to get done. All right. Thanks for watching, guys.